you and I are on the same page, Shadowheart. Oh, uh, what is this? <gasps> There's nothing here. It's dead. Hells. The great worm is nothing but bone and memories. Oh, that's unfortunate. Did it starve to death or what happened? Can I use Speak with the Dead on a you dragon? To Dali. <gasps> Tell me I can use Speak with Dead on a dragon. Can't target undead. So it's it's not mind. actually well a corpse. In it. What's in here? Is this thing gonna wake up on me as I get it? Oh it is! It totally is. The dragon spirit floods your mind and memory in a great torrent of power. He is with you. He is within you. He is. Ah, uh, that's cool. The next words that spill from your mouth are not yours, but the worms. <laughs> I am Ansor. Heart of the gate. Butchered in flesh. Risen. In spirit. Oh, baby. Search your mind for what Answer possesses it. Wends his way through your mind like an unstoppable river. Your body is unmoving, yet thought flows effortlessly between you. The spirit pauses, and you feel the astral prism stir. Ansor senses the Emperor's presence within it. Oh, Ansor, Facey. Why have you come? I meant you no harm. Just let me go. A deep sigh resonates within you. The torrent stills, only disturbed by the dragon's next words. Brack, my words aren't meant for you. They're meant for him. Did mind the flare. Emperor stirs in the astral prism, then in you, calm, curious, and detached. Bolduran. Your presence has stirred me, as it ever did. Uh, this is cool. I am awakened. Answer. It's been too long. What? Whoa, 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 whoa. Is this? This is the fucking plot twist. He just called him Balderon. So the Emperor is literally Balderon, the founder of the city, and he's the one who became the Mind Flayer. A name I once answered to. A name I did not expect to hear. No way. Least of all from the mouth of an old friend. Friend. Yes. And more. Until you killed me. Oh. Have you come to dance on my bones, Alderan? Was slaying me not satisfaction enough? Satisfaction? No. You left me no choice. You had every choice. You were becoming illithid. I offered you merciful death. You chose to fight. And now you bring your thrall before me. How far has the great Balderan fallen? Answer the question, Mind Flayer. You owe it to the both of us. Stillness. Ansur's consciousness hovers just above yours, searching, seeing. Dear Ansur, enough! I gave you everything, Baldoran, and you repaid me in slaughter. It is time I return the favor. Oh no! Let my bones rise and the storms gather. Witness Bordoran. The final tempest has come. Oh no, are we gonna have to fight this dragon I am now? The heart of the gate. I am the one who roars 
Oh, I legit have to fight the dragon. Oh man, this is brutal. I wonder if you still have to fight him if you have Will in the party. I'm gonna shield myself. Oh man, this is not good. 279 hit points. All right, the first thing I'm doing is I'm gonna drop Sleet Storm. Now he's gonna be able to move away from it, but it should keep him from immediately casting. All right, we're going Owl Bear. I need as many hit points as possible. Need to act fast. Wow. Um. Let's go with. Shoot, I really don't know. A twenty percent. Why do I have only have a 20% to hit? Highly resistant to necrotic lightning poison. Oh, it has resistance on saving throws against any turn dead effects. Does he just have really good resistances? Because it said that only has a 20% chance to hit him. And I'm just like, how is that only 20%? Well. can't do shit with her right now. This is really unfortunate. Like, none of her spells are wanting to land on this thing. Other than this, Moonbeam would hit. It's not gonna do that much. Damn it, she got stuck in the frickin' on the double. No no! Gale, 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 Gale. I I just screwed the pooch on this fight, guys. I did two things. I did I made two mistakes right there. We're totally screwed. I don't know how we're gonna survive this. Yep, because it's gonna yeet on out of here. And probably do a breath weapon on us. I need to do another sleet spell if I can. Yep, yep, there it goes. Fuck. Well, let's pull a planar ally out of my butt.
she's missing, critical missing. Victory is assured. Oh, man, I feel like we should probably just go full on magic missile at this point because it's got such good resistances against Door everything ahead. else. Probably need to get out of the water. What's it gonna do? Oh, that doesn't look good. I'm assuming we don't want to be near that when it goes off. I'm gonna take the hit. Big, we'll go home. Um, can we hit with one of those spells again, or is it still gonna be like 20%? 25, it's worth it. Let's just do it. Better than nothing. Oh, it went right through the moonbeam. Oh shit! Lazale got feared! I just lost out on her attacks. I speak, they burn. All right, magic missiles, buddy. Don't let me down, Gale. Actually, you know what? We're gonna go back over here. We're gonna recover a sixth level, sixth level slot, and we're gonna burn it with a sixth level magic missile and hopefully kill it. Oh, we got this. No! It still has eight hit points! No! Oh, somebody's gonna die. I don't think any of us survived. Oh, my, my gin survived. Dude! What have you done? Dude! I legit survived that fight because of my gin. <laughs> ah! I never thought I'd see him again. How much more of your past are you not telling me about? My past is past. I concealed nothing from you. I simply left out the details that were not pertinent to our cause. But it seems you are interested in I just need to know if you're going to kill me like you killed your last friend. I killed Anso out of necessity. Not out of survival. For the crime of being a lithid, he would have killed me first. It's like I always told you. I was just like you. An adventurer who yearned for greatness. And in mortal terms, I achieved it. As captain of the Wandering Eye, I acquired enough gold to found Baldur's Gate. I stayed for a while to watch my city grow, but it was not enough. I grew restless again. The sea called to me, and I ran to her with open arms. Life at sea was not easy. Our last adventure was ruinous. My ship was destroyed. My crew lost, but my spirit was far from broken. I was determined to return in triumph once again. I heard of treasure in Moonrise. I strove to find it. What I found was an illithid colony, where I acquired a tadpole much like yours, and became a mind flayer, enthralled to the Elder Brain. 
It was Ansor who found me. Ansor who pulled me from the brain's domination. Ansor who brought me home. He sought to cure me of my sickness, called on every healer he could find, nearly broke his spirit in the attempt. But he failed to understand. I wanted no healing. I was not sick. You sound You're definitely like sick. Even after he had exhausted all possibility of reversing my condition, he still clung to hope. I tried to convince him of my reality. I was on the cusp of greatness beyond my wildest dreams. But all he could see was a mind flayer. He came to me as I slept. A mercy killing in his mind. I saw the tears. I felt his grief. I had no choice but to kill him first. It was an act of self-preservation. Hmm. I don't really like any of these options. Yeah, I admire your commitment to survival, but your methods are questionable. There were no alternatives. In my place, you would have done the same. Do not think that I am ignorant of what I have lost. I may not regret my actions, but I do regret that they were necessary. While the past is beyond my influence, the present is not. It is time we move on. One nether stone remains. We must find it before the brain breaks free. Well, what's the dragon got on it for loot? Uh, a note. Dear answer, I've said it a thousand times and I'll say it again. There's no cure, and that's all right. Remember Yal Tengri? You and I sailed together for months seeking the Great Spire. By the time we found it, we were sick of dogs. But you never left my side, not even for a moment. Be free, answer, fly, and know that even if I'm not beside you, I'll always have been your Baldurin. Alright, Baldurian's Giant Slayer. Legendary Greatsword, which is going to Lazale immediately. Um, on on a hit, double the strength from your strength modif double the damage from your strength modifier. This weapon grants you advantage on attack rolls against large, huge, or gargantuan creatures. And also has this thing called giant form. Grow to a fearsome size, your weapons deal. An additional 1d6 damage, you gain 27 temporary hit points and advantage on strength checks and saving throws. Yes, please. We're going to give that to Lazale immediately. Action, not reaction. <laughs> Where's it at? Oh yeah, it's in this. It's in my other inventory. Oh, way better than the one I've got. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So cool, man. Actually, is it better? It kind of is. Holy crap! It's massive. Oh my God, Lasale. <laughs> Ah! Look at that beast of a sword. Oh. That thing is ridiculous big. All right. All right. We need some heals. What's next? All right, so that's the killing of Answer, which I honestly wish we didn't have to do. I really wished we could have saved him, um, and I don't know if it's going to be different when we come here with Will or if it's the same outcome no matter what, um, but at the very least, that's done, 
And now we move on. Figure out what everything is. If, if, just see if there's anything else in this chamber. It's really unfortunate. They, I feel like every time we turn around, Balderon, you know, the Emperor is just becoming a bigger and bigger douchebag. And really making me, you know, feel a lot less like he's forced to be in the position that he's in and that he's there because he wants to be in that position. Um, there's something down here. The helm of Balderon. Is this going to be the helm? Oh, man. Wasn't this the helm in um, Baldur's Gate 2? Worm's Tempest and his roar hurtle through you. Ansur's essence still lives within the helm. Instilling you with power for as long as you wear it. All right, who can wear it? That's the big thing. And we got a route out of here now. Well, let's let's check this helmet. That's the Cerebox helmet. Hang on, what are we looking for here? Here it is. Yeah, I'm, 